Loop, loop, loop. Microsoft Loop is now on the market. Today, we're going to give you an overview of what it is, what it does, and who it's best for, and give you an idea of whether it's right for you as well. So my name is Francesco D'Alessio and welcome to this channel. Please do subscribe and check out all the links in the description below if you fancy exploring more about Microsoft Loop and all of the other applications. So Microsoft Loop was actually launched a long time ago technically as something called Fluid Framework, which essentially uh, is a technology from Microsoft that allows you to communicate using none other than your Microsoft 365 app. It's very cool. You could, for example, communicate just in Teams and create this ongoing component that communicates in without the need of any set site. It's very interesting software. But that's evolved over the last couple of years into something that Microsoft are calling Microsoft Loop. And as a Canvas-like experience that includes three core elements. It includes workspaces, pages, and components. Now, workspace is essentially projects for you to organize your areas, and pages are essentially places where you can organize your loop components or any other 365 documents that you have living and breathing inside of your 365 account. But components are probably the most unique element. As I just mentioned, you can create these components and they can live wherever you're using Microsoft 365. So if you're having a conversation in Teams, you can collaborate on that loop component without having to go into anything and you can start utilizing it and reacting in real time to other people collaborating. So it's a very interesting aspect that definitely takes the loop component aspect a lot further than apps like Notion if you're in the 365 ecosystem. But when it comes to other core experiences like advanced databases, integrations, and other elements that are part of the Canvas experience, Microsoft Loop doesn't really compare to Notion. So who is Microsoft Loop for? Microsoft Loop at time of filming is currently in public preview. But if you have a Microsoft 365 account and you're looking to integrate a Canvas-like experience like Notion or Coda, into your Microsoft 365 workflow, this could be a good option for you. And if you're looking to improve the collaboration between those in your team who are communicating on Teams, OneNote, and in meetings, this could be a nice add-on for your experience. Still early days for Microsoft Loop, but a very interesting start at that. You can find our full guide to Microsoft Loop and I'll put that link in the description below as well. But a big, big thank you for stopping by and I really hope that you find the productivity app for you. You can subscribe here on this channel and I look forward to seeing you in a future video. Cheerio, folks.